what are the financial impacts of climate change on households? Like, could, could you lay out some of the big ways that uh, a warming climate might impact people's wallets? These days, most people are already worried about climate change, but we still think it's a future issue or one that's affecting the polar bears or the ice sheets, but not us. Unfortunately, that's not true. So one of the biggest ways that climate change is already affecting almost all of us across the U.S. and in Canada, too, and other places as well, is through our home insurance rates. Our home insurance rates are skyrocketing, especially in places that are very vulnerable to climate fueled extremes. Like where I live in Texas, our homeowners insurance has gone up significantly. In Florida, it has as well. In California, wherever you get the hurricanes and the wildfires, in some places, people can't even get home insurance anymore. And if you can't get home insurance, you can't get a good mortgage either. So that's one of the biggest things that we're seeing. And, and it's not even places that are prone to extreme weather, right? I mean, it's places that might be in the middle of the country or maybe in the Northeast where you wouldn't uh, typically associate it with extreme weather. Well, that's exactly right. Uh, in Minnesota, for example, because of the increases in extreme precipitation they've seen over the last 20 plus years, home insurance and flood insurance there has skyrocketed as well. So wherever we live these days, we are vulnerable to extreme weather conditions, but the types of extreme weather that's getting worse where we live depends on what part of the country we're in. 